I'm taking the dog down. It began with a video. An acquaintance starts a group chat, adds a bunch of women, posts a video of herself sharing the mission she believes she has, to empower and uplift other women. Cool, noble cause, go for it. My friend works for her. So I asked if they are editing videos for her. They confirm and continue she has the time and money to get her hair, nails and makeup done to film a couple minutes of video. But her dog is lying here dying. Of course I asked for further clarification. This is, naturally, not an expected progression of a conversation around a video. She has a large breed dog, beautiful creature, but, sadly, no effort has been made to train this animal. All cute when it's unruly and rambunctious as a puppy sure, but the same and worse as a full grown dog not great. She also has smaller dogs. Large dog bit smaller dog not the first small dog it has bitten either. Small dog is just left to walk it off for several days, until the bite marks got infected and septic. Dog is literally hiding itself in small places, not eating, and waiting for the end. Now before I go further, please understand I am not sharing this for any sort of praise. I'm just excited to have a story to share for a change, pity it has to be because of such circumstances. Upon hearing this, I get in my car and head over to her place. Basically took the dog, she let me, and headed to the vet to get him treated. Four drains in an overnight stay at the very hospital. We have a recovering pup, still losing streams of pus out of the drains, but much happier and chipper. Pup has a new home with people who adore him, and I had my legally blonde scene, though I only really spoke that iconic line in my head. 